Do you remember sitting in your high school algebra class and asking yourself, when am I ever going to use this in real life? And then wouldn't you know it, you run into a situation where advanced math was completely necessary. Well, this next app is exactly the same. You're probably thinking, when will I ever be attacked by strawberries? Why would I ever need to fight off an orange? Well, it's better to be safe than sorry, and that's why Fruit Ninja HD is our next app. You might consider Fruit Ninja a game, but it could also be seen as an essential life skill. The situation is this. There's fruit coming at you, a whole lot of fruit, and you need to fight it off in order to survive. The game has a few different settings, classic, zen, arcade, and connect. The classic setting is exactly what it sounds like, your traditional attack by fruit scenario. You need to defend yourself by slicing and dicing with the swipe of your finger across the screen. It goes without saying that you need to avoid slicing the bombs lobbed at you. You slice a bomb or miss three pieces of fruit, and it's game over. Zen Mode offers a single 90 second round with no bombs. The object here is to get the highest score possible before the time runs out. Arcade Mode is similar in that you have a time limit and you can't die, but it offers power-ups and double points. Bombs are a factor here and hitting one will cost you 10 points. And finally, Connect. You can access Game Center, which allows you to play head-to-head -head with friends or random strangers who are training in some vitamin C related combat. Everyone is assigned a color of fruit. Slice yours and not your opponents. Play long enough and you can learn the secrets of unlocking new backgrounds and blade colors. The game is highly addictive, but as you can probably guess, after a while, it can get a little old. I mean, once you've mastered protecting yourself against fruit, you start thinking about real philosophical questions, like, can I take on vegetables? Oh yeah. and send messages to your contacts using BlackBerry Messenger. Follow these simple instructions and you'll be sending BBM messages in no time. The process begins on your home screen. Click the menu key and then select the BlackBerry Messenger icon. Welcome to the BBM Instant Messenger application. On the contact list screen, click the menu key, then invite contact. Select invite by sending a PIN or email message. Enter a person's email address or PIN number and then click send. You can also add contacts by scanning their barcodes. Here's how you can do that. On the contact screen, click the menu key and then invite contact. Select scan a person's barcode and then click continue. Hold your device so that all four corners of the barcode appear on your screen. Continue to hold the device until you hear it beep. Keep in mind that this contact might remain in the pending category until they respond to your invitation. Once you've added contacts, sending BBM messages is easy. Select the contact in the main menu, then simply type in a message and click send. Congratulations, now you're ready to chat with your friends using BlackBerry Messenger. If ever there was an app that was designed to help you out in a mall, and I mean virtually any mall, this is the one. Well, some of us may need more help than others, We'll take a look at Fast Mall after the break, and we'll show you how to use your smartphone when you're out shopping in the malls or stores to help you get a deal. All that and a whole lot more when App TV continues. Well, they're hot, and there are five of them. That's why we call this segment Hot Five. This time around, it's all about making the most of shopping with our shopping list apps. Starting out, we have Remember the Milk. This app allows you to add and check off completed tasks on the go. Sync up with Remember the Milk online for backing up your notes and tasks. Get reminders via email, text messaging, and instant messenger so you can prompt yourself to do things and never again forget to pick up the milk. Whether it's goat, soy, or good old 2%. Up next, Grocery Gadget. This app gives you a barcode scan feature for price checks and lets you sync up shopping lists with other family members so everyone knows who's buying what. This prevents the embarrassment of getting home with five jars of mustard. E-coupons are available through Grocery Gadget to help save you money and even a picture feature to help confirm you're buying the right thing or if you just like photos of food. Green Grocer is our next shop till you drop app. As you pick up your items, shake your device and they'll immediately go to the bottom of the list. Green Grocer offers location where shopping, meaning it can remember your shopping habits and will identify nearby items for you. Is someone watching you shop? Well, Big Brother is not only watching, he's shopping too. Next, Grocery IQ. 
This app has a database of millions of items, so you can build your grocery list easily or just buy the millions of items. It also allows you to scan barcodes and add items to your list quickly. If necessary, the Grocery IQ app also gives you the space to add notes about items like size, quantity, and price. Last up, we're taking a look at Splash Shopper List Manager. If you're a king or queen of the list scene, then you might want to consider this app. It comes with some preloaded lists like emergency items, travel checklists, wine recommendation, and the list goes on and on. Whether you're shopping or making lists of places to shop, Splash Shopper List Manager should be near the top of your list. It's time again to look at the apps that are in the league of their own. Do you remember how you asked your husband or wife to marry you in a unique, interesting, or intimate way? Well, why the heck did you do that? The Will You Marry Me app takes all the respect, hope, and love out of the equation. It reduces it to nothing more than artificially generated sounds and images. You'll still be talking about this on your 50th wedding anniversary, obviously with someone other than the person you use this on. And if you only thought there was one app that can help you pop the question, you were way off base. There's also Marry Me. Apparently this one does it all and even comes with virtual rings. You can choose where to have your ceremony too. But be warned, it's only gonna happen in Paris, London, or Vegas. Now there's a surprise. And to wrap all this up in a nice little package, we have the Woo button. Yeah! Woo! That's right, you press it and it says Woo. That's after you use one of the proposal apps and he or she says yes, you now have the proper way to celebrate. Have you ever walked into a store and immediately forgotten what it is you were going to buy or end up leaving with 10 or maybe even 20 bags but are missing specifically that one item that you went to go get? Well, hopefully that's a thing of the past as we show you some apps that will help turn you into a supermarket superhero, making sure you get everything you need and even maybe saving a buck or two. Kicking it off, let's take a helping hand from Kitchen Helper. So you find this great recipe and you're all set to make this magical meal when the diet restrictions start coming in. From lactose intolerance to being a vegetarian like me, people are often picky about what they want to eat, but that doesn't mean that you have to throw away your entire recipe. Kitchen Helper's main purpose is to help you find alternatives so that you can serve the meal you want. Just enter the ingredient that needs to be eliminated and let the app find an acceptable substitute. This can be used to find lower fat ingredients or even less spicy ingredients as well. The app breaks the food down by category and food group to make searching even easier. Now if only they made a version that cooked the recipe, we'd be set. Next up, they said you can't compare them, but this app is out to prove them wrong. It's apples to oranges, the ultimate in comparative shopping. Whether it's the price of the item or the calories in them, this app will help keep your wallet fat and you thin, just the way I like it. Do you want to know if it's better to pay more for a bigger portion at the grocery store? Then just enter the amounts and the price, and the app will let you know if you really are getting the better deal by buying the larger item. It could be mayo, sugar, pasta. In some cases, bigger may not always be better. The same approach can be used for calories. Just check out the nutritional info of the products in question and compare them in serving sizes, whether it be in cups, ounces, or tablespoons. Last but not least, we come to I Spoil. It's estimated that North Americans throw out 20 million tons of domestic grown food per year and food costs rose by 7.3% in Canada last year. Those two things combined show us how much money we waste by wasting food. That's where I Spoil comes in, by helping us keep on top of things. All you need to do is enter in what you're buying in the expiry dates of the products. The app will log it and send you push notifications to let you know what's in your fridge or cupboard and how much time you have left before it goes bad. If you take the time to enter the info, you'll end up saving hundreds of dollars a year and prevent those strange science experiments from developing the dark corners of your fridge. For some, malls can be a frustrating experience, dealing with the crowds, finding the stores you want, finding the sales finding you want. Finding the food court hey. or the bathroom. This app takes everything from parking to purchasing into consideration when it comes to the mall. It's called Fast Mall, and it helps you find stores and sales, 
can show you the fastest way to the closest bathroom for people like him, and lets you connect with others to give reviews and share tips of your own. The breakdown of the stores is done by category, and the app even provides phone numbers for all the stores listed. It's a one-stop shop for multiple stop shopping. And that about wraps it up this time. Thanks for watching App TV. We'll see you next time. You're still rolling to the mall right now, aren't you? Yep. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. App TV is brought to you by TELUS.